Do you know what happens if you die without a will in Canada? Hi, my name is Will Chen and I'm an articled student here at Bell Alliance and I'd like to take a moment to talk to you about what happens if you die without a will. Now most people assume if you die without a will your spouse will automatically get all your property. That's not necessarily true. The government instead will decide what happens to all the property that you personally own. For all assets that you own jointly with your spouse, your spouse will automatically get 100% ownership. This typically includes items like your joint bank account, as well as your family home. For all other property that you might own, for instance, your car, your boat, possibly a second home, any expensive jewelry, watches, or any other family heirlooms, these will all become part of your estate and the government will decide who gets what from that estate. The current rules that the government has in place says your spouse will get the first $65,000 of your estate as well as a half or a third interest in the remainder of your estate including a life interest in the family home as well as all the home furnishings. The remainder half or the remainder one two-thirds of the estate will then go directly to your children. Now in some cases this might not necessarily differ from your own intentions however for most people they would rather not have someone else tell them where their property will go. So to avoid any of these undesired outcomes, it's a good idea for you to take the time now to prepare a will that properly provides for your loved ones. If you have any more questions, please feel free to contact any of the lawyers here at Bell Alliance and we would be happy to help you.